Hi, I'm John Kaleska with Breaking Muscle. Today I'm with Erica Schreck, a Reiki master, and we're going to talk about Reiki and how it can affect athletic performance as well as healing. Mm -hmm. Hi, Erica. Hi, John. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me here. So what is Reiki? Reiki is a hands-on form of healing. Um, it's, it's a spiritual, non-invasive modality um, that a lot of people use like any other healing modality like massage or acupuncture. It kind of falls in that school. Um, it has Japanese origin and it basically means divine light energy that is being guided in to align your energy within. Cool. And how could Reiki specifically help athletic performance? Reiki can really benefit athletes in that it really works from the inside out. Um, athletes are constantly doing, you know, you're doing a lot to your body um, and your doers. So it's kind of nice to go from the inside out, from the emotional, the spiritual perspective of things. And it's a great complementary um, kind of approach as well. So it works really well with the physical therapy you might be doing or the, the workouts and things like that too. Yeah, I can give my experience with Reiki. Like as you know, I injured my shoulder a few yes. years ago and had tried everything I can think of to mm -hmm. fix it. Acupuncture, rolfing, and things like that. Mm -hmm. And they really did help with the pain management and increasing range of motion. But after my Reiki session, I really felt this sense of balance mm -hmm. and that this sense of stability really came from the inside. Does that make sense? It does, it does. And that's, that's exactly what I'm saying. All those great things like acupuncture, massage, um, do those too. Reiki is just that really nice complement to, again, get at those internal issues, which might be emotional, um, they might be spiritual things, and it might just be thoughts as well, just those beliefs that are placing that limit on you um, that can be lifted, and you can even do more. Cool. And can you describe a typical Reiki session, what that would be like? Definitely. Um, typical Reiki session is going to feel at first a lot like a massage session or acupuncture. You're going to be on a massage table typically, but it can be done in a chair or wherever is comfortable for the client. And um, it's very light touch and it can also be done with hands hovering over the body. Um, but really what I'm doing as a practitioner is I'm a glorified pipe. I'm just bringing in <laughs> divine energy and trying to make you more balanced and help you see um, where there might be um, some, some areas in the body that need attention and healing. And if somebody wanted to find a practitioner in their area, how could somebody find a Reiki practitioner? Actually, good old Google is wonderful. Um, just Googling Reiki and either your city or zip code works very well. And I also highly recommend Reiki.org, and Reiki is spelled R-E-I-K-I. -I. Cool. And I'll include links to that with the notes to this video. So thank you, Erica. Thanks, John. Yeah, I'm John Kalaska with Breaking Muscle.